Hello. Beep. Beep. Is it big now? Hi guys. So as you guys may know, this is my husband, James. A lot of you guys were wondering how we met, so we figured we would do a video today talking just about that. Yeah. And instead of it being just us sat here talking, like I've seen other videos on YouTube, I figured I would cut Dan's hair at the same time so there's more going on because then it's not boring me. So my channel is The Traveling Barber and I aim to travel the world and do some really cool haircuts and some like crazy destinations and like completely out of there, like out of the salon, out of like a barber shop and just do something crazy. And then while we're traveling as well, as we meet people along the way, then I'll use those people to cut their hair. So then it will be like a great way to like get to know people as well. It'll be fun. We met at Starbucks. <laughs> we did meet at Starbucks. I was visiting LA in, yeah, June 2019 I came over and I went and did a competition for Andrew Christian underwear model mm. and while I was there I met Nick who I'm sure a few of you might know. I've done a bunch of videos with him. Yeah, and Dan's done videos with him. So, I met Nick while I was there and then um, when I came back down to LA because that was held up in Sacramento, um, me and Nick hung out and then he was going to a house party on the beach and invited me along and then I ended up riding in the car with Dan and um, Nick went in a different car so I was left to work with people that I had no idea who they were or anything like that. So that's how we met. So we ended up going to the house party and we had fun and I just like, you know, got to know Daniel and I got to know like everyone a little bit better and yeah, it was like a crazy like day slash night slash next day. Um, I ended up getting in the same car to go back with Dan um, because uh, there was like, that's who we came with and stuff like that. And then the whole group was like hanging out together like all the time anyway. We were just all hanging out every day together. Every yeah. Day. It was like just after July 4th and everyone was like in summer mode. Everyone was like hanging out all together, like having parties and every party I seemed to go to, Dan was at and like our friends were like pretty much the same group of friends at that time. So um, yeah, we just like hung out a whole bunch and got to know each other as well as everyone else and so yeah had a cool beach party that was super fun and so yeah we got married <laughs> at the end of the year last year and then coronavirus hit so that's been crazy and then we decided that LA was just not the place to be for us so we found this really cool program called work away and Basically you help out a family in exchange to like live there and they pay for your food and everything. So the, we found one that has an apartment um, that they give us. So we live in this apartment and we help them out a few days a week and then everything else is included. So it's pretty cool. So we've been doing that since May. It's like the perfect situation for like coronavirus as well because we're like have like an acre and we get like the awesome backyard and um, like we're looking after the cat like full time he lives with us right now his name is Eric it's like a perfect situation really it's been a really nice summer here yeah and we haven't had to pay rent so that's been amazing but our next place we're thinking is going to be Hawaii so um, here in the next few months Dan's James been has never to, been <laughs> Dan's been to Hawaii I've never been I've been a bunch of times. But Dan always went to the mainland, so I think we're gonna try and go to like Maui or the big, big island. island. Yeah, that would be super cool to do the big island. So we were actually looking at land there and it's super cheap. So yeah. we're thinking about buying a spot of land for like investing in the future. That would be pretty cool. So if everyone wants to go and buy a block of land, we can make like a big gay village there. <laughs> so me and James are going to do a really cool video so um as you guys know i used to have a personal trainer which i don't since i moved anymore and we thought it would be cool to do 
What is it? 100 push-ups a day for a month? Well, um, I'm thinking like we start off at like 10 push-ups for the day and then we increase it by 5 every day for the month. So like we start off doing 10, then 15, 20, 25, etc. And then, um, well, you're going away as well this weekend for like yeah. three weeks. So we're going to be apart for three weeks. So we're going to like see if we can see the change in each other's bodies when we like see each other again. So I've been a hairdresser since I was like 18. Yeah, 17 to 32, I've been like a hairdresser and a barber. Um, fun fact, I'm actually allergic to hair color, which meant my job was really hard. Um, so I quit that and did barbering instead. The past three years now I've been traveling, so I haven't really worked like full time or anything. I lived on an island in Cambodia, and when I lived there I'd do haircuts on the beach for like five dollars, and that was like my main source of income. So, I mean, I made so much money, I like didn't ever have to work again. <laughs> Cambodia's cheap. Yeah. And it was like two bucks. Yeah, I made more money. I made. I left with more money than I had going there. We just ordered the Sony A7S III 4K camera, and we have some huge things that we're gonna do for our channel. It's gonna be super exciting. So after coronavirus, in a few months, <laughs> hopefully, we are going to be traveling all over the world, taking you guys with us everywhere we go, and we're gonna make amazing vlogging um, travel videos. It's gonna be really exciting, but our first stop will be Hawaii since we live in America. Um, it'll be easier to go there first. I just got my scissors from Australia in the post like yesterday, so I'm so excited. Before I was using like shit scissors from Target. Ta-da! Well, Dan has a fresh new haircut. Thank you. God, after the clippers died like three times. Oh, and I think I remember seeing someone comment like what I do at the back. Normally I just taper it, but today we've gone like super short, so it's like a zero. Um, so there's like no hair anyway at the bottom. Thanks for the haircut. It's okay. <laughs> so I'll leave a link to James's channel in the description, <laughs> or I'll put a little card there so you can just click on it and go say hi. All right, so we'll talk to you guys later. Hope you all have a wonderful day. Peace.